morning, you guys. It is Monday, August 19, 2013. I had a really hard time falling asleep last night for some reason, so I slept in a bit late today. I'm so tired. I don't really have anything else to say about today. I'm just tired. So, I'm just me. Uh, breakfast this morning is cream of wheat with unsweetened almond milk. Yum. I decided to have a second bowl of uh, cream wheat with unsweetened almond milk. I'm going to skip my snack later and have a lighter lunch. And I should make up for it. Yum! Salad with apple, baby carrots, like 10 baby carrots, uh, walnut, a little bit of uh, red peppers, Spring mix and no dressing this time. I feel like having no dressing. Yum. Hey guys, um, I was just uh, washing my hands in the bathroom after using the potty, and I was noticing how my arms. I could see more of my muscles. You know, just stuff that I haven't seen in a while. I like, huh. am. I decided to do some measurements, and I've lost another inch in my biceps. So. I mean, look at that. It's so amazing. I mean, look at those muscles. I love them. It's like amazing, you know, to me that I have these amazing muscles. Like, especially these right here. I love these. These are like the coolest things since sliced bread. Um, I've also lost a half an inch in my, in my hip area, which I was noticing a little bit of that too, because it's it's different in that area that and um like if I lean on my hip too long I start to notice because there's less fat there so you know I have to be careful when I'm sleeping and I like to sleep on my side so I have to adjust if I if I lay too long on one in one position uh but yeah other than that everything else is the same uh, I'm, I'm a little disappointed with my thighs because there have been some, I've been noticing subtle changes there, like the muscles are becoming more defined, but the, 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 the size has not changed. And I, and I definitely have fat there that needs to go bye-bye. But, you know, I guess I'll just be patient, you know. The fact that I'm seeing any changes at all is good. The fact that I've lost another inch in my arm. They were a little flabby on the bottom, and they're not as flabby. I lost another inch. <laughs> I'm starting to get lean and mean. <gasps> I don't know. I'm just—it's—it's it's a little thing to celebrate, but I'm happy about it, so I want to share. So I'm just. Hey guys, I just work at five. I forgot how hard it is. I mean, it is one of my favorites still. It's just, it's, it's difficult. Um, it's hard. It's, um, more arms. And I did better than I have in the past, but I still had to pause a few times. You know, my personal pausing that I do when it gets to be too much and I don't want to pull something or hurt myself. And it's only for a few seconds that I pause, so it's not like I'm stopping very long. It's just I have to give myself a chance. And I forgot this is when the chopper, the the wood chops start. So yeah, I considered it more of a high impact, and I looked up what high, if I were doing all high impact, which is aerobics, which is uh, keeping your heart rate way high. Um, that would have been 291, and it comes out because I, I edited the time. It comes out for 37 minutes to be 241. So I'm I'm okay with 241. It may start going higher than that later on, but right now the 241 is good enough for me. Um, yeah, I knew it was going to be torturous because I knew, and it was harder than uh, once before. And it was hard. Um, still really hard for me to do those. Uh, those ones that you lay down and, and you put one arm like on here and, and you lift yourself up with the opposite arm. My right arm is still very weak. It's still very weak. 
So, of course, the, and my right arm always has been an issue because uh, it used to be the lower part of the arm, now it's the upper part. Just triceps, a lot of tricep in this, uh, at these exercises, and it's, it's harsh, it's harsh. But I'm getting stronger, which is really making me happy. And there is a lot of legs in this, and I have to really work at getting those legs in the right position so that my legs can finally start stretching this crap out so I can finally get rid of all this excess fat. And I'm, I still have, like, flapping stuff going around when I'm bouncing around, so it's annoying. It's frustrating, but I, I seriously think it's going to start happening. It's, I'm... I have a little more muscle development to happen. That's usually the first week of doing it, and then the next week I should lose some weight. At least I'm hoping. I'm I'm hoping. Uh, beyond hoping. Because I, I think what has been happening since I noticed that I lost an inch on my biceps and a half an inch in my uh, hip area, what's been happening is because I was so lazy for two and a half to three months, Things got a little flabby, you know, muscle-wise. So things tightened up, and I started gaining muscle again. So that's why I haven't lost anything, really, other than, like, a pound. So hopefully this week or next, I'll start seeing more pounds falling off. That would be nice. And I, if I remember right, the fair, when I first did this, I didn't lose that much weight the first month. Because the first month is all about toning. So you gain more muscle. You lose fat, but you gain more muscle. I didn't lose a lot of fat this time because, you know, I'm having trouble with my foods, too. Especially on weekends. God, weekends are horrible for me. I don't know why weekends are so terrible. I think it's just because I've got so much more idle time. And, like, during the week, I have crap I'm doing, you know. I've, I've got work, responsibilities, stress about, uh, other stuff to stress about, and I just, yeah, it's stupid. Anyway, I'm going to go. Probably snack time for me because... It's been a three or four hours since I ate last. And after working out, I kind of need something. So, let's hope that this week sees a loss. That would be nice. It doesn't have to be much. Just a pound or two would be nice. I've been stuck at 149 point whatever for, you know, two weeks now. I'd really like to see some losses here. You know, I'd like to get below 149. It would be nice. This is really slow going. Really slow going. But I, I'm not complaining about my my new muscles in my arms, and and I can feel them today. <laughs> and I'm I'm looking forward to seeing them getting more defined, and I'm hoping to see abs by the end of this phase. Because I know they're there. I can I can tell that they're coming. I just they're not quite come he, at here yet. They're, they're like more obvious that they're going to come than they were. Anyway, that's it for now. My snack is scrambled eggs. Two scrambled eggs. Yum! This is spaghetti, obviously. It's uh, Stater Brothers uh, whole grain uh, thin spaghetti with uh, it's uh, two tomatoes. Uh, stir fried with uh, four small red uh, peppers. Then I added. Uh, God, what else did I add? Um, then I added. What's the green stuff? Uh, chard. Oh, let's see what else is on this list. Dinner, dinner, dinner. Uh, yeah, and then there was, like, I added garlic powder, and I added some salt, some pepper, a little bit of sugar, um, oregano, I also used, uh, extra virgin olive oil, um, gosh, um, paprika, uh, yeah, it's delicious, I like it. So yum, yum, popcorn time, nom nom nom, nom.